Hi, this is Nathan Mature with uh, Hi, this is Nathan Mature with board number 24. I'll show the board number after I'm done with all this with the rest of the stuff I'm doing. I'm going to do in this video. What I have is a Lego uh, sonar th thing that uh, rotates uh, 90 degrees uh, towards the camera and then 90 degrees away from the camera. Um, and while it's doing that, it's reading the sonar values, which will probably reflect off this box here. And uh, it's graphing them uh, by um, graphing them in another program, which you'll see on the screen, if you can see it. it has to focus. Um, and it'll graph the angle at what, where it's taking uh, the readings, and it'll, the, the, it'll also graph the distance that's taken away. So I'll connect it to the power, and it should start running immediately. And then I'll run the the, the the processing program and then I'll press reset on my Arduino board which will get it the whole thing in sync and here we go so connect the power <gasps> here we go one two three okay should start momentarily and I'll have to do the processing thing okay so I'm gonna, so you see it's rotating back and forth. Now I'm gonna run the processor and then and then reset the Arduino. So you See it going back and forth, and you see it graphing on the screen the distances. So I'll move this box over here, and you'll start seeing values. So you can see accumulating a lot. Until you more rotate the box again, you'll see different values. See the numbers changing. Shake your camera and all. Okay. So I think that's, and there's a graph after I, it's different because I moved the, this box a little bit over from its original position, so I started reading different values. And yeah, I think that's all. Um, I'll disconnect the power so that it'll stop. Uh, and then uh, show my board number, which is board number 24. And fortunately, the current mark is worn off on the other breadboard, but it's board number 24. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed the video, and yeah, peace out.